minutes you go to an expert and uh, we've got someone who is number one, a funeral celebrant who is an expert in that field, but he's also one of the great figures in uh, music on radio in this country over many, many years. Pete Graham, who was with 2WS, he was on TUE. He pioneered Jukebox Saturday Night. He knows his music inside out. So as someone who now presides over funerals, and does it in that way that uh, blends the music. He's the perfect man to talk about this. Pete, good evening. What a pleasure it is to speak with you. And thank you so much, John, and uh, thank you for that very kind introduction. I really appreciate that, my friend. Yes, I, I have been helping families for about 10 years in parallel with uh, my radio career, and it's really good to be able to put something back into society. And yes, uh, the hymns uh, definitely uh, have been replaced in the majority of funerals uh, by songs about the person. And, and this is a big difference now. Uh, a religious ceremony is about the person, but it's more about God and heaven and what you're going to do. But more and more people want the farewell, the funeral, to be about their loved one. They're that saying person. goodbye to that person. Yeah, it, it, it's quite interesting because I'm, I'm, I had a conversation. It's quite, well, I guess it sounds a bit uh, macabre having a conversation with the family, and I was saying, I don't want a funeral. And they said, well, actually, yeah, well, you know, all the other people will want to have it. Doesn't matter. You won't be here. And they, yeah. they said you got to have it. And so, yeah. you know, and yeah. I'm thinking, what would you play at the funeral? And so, yeah. you know, how involved do you get? Because I know when my mother passed away, I was almost numb. So it was very hard to make any decisions. So, how, how involved yeah. do you get in helping people and steering them through and choosing the music? Well, what I always do, I go out and sit down with the family and as many of their friends as, as need be. And we sit down. We, we just talk about who the person is, their kind of nature, their character, who the family are. And then I build a profile in my own head. And then I start to design a farewell service. Now, obviously, there's going to be certain things that are common in all funerals. But I try and make it individual. Uh, I've heard of people turning up at the cemeteries where they have three chapels, go to the wrong one and not really realise in the wrong chapel service. So I always make it to my point that no matter where you are in that service, it is about that person. It is about the person. And, yeah. Yeah, look, look, look this, is, this is the number two song, and it's, a, again, yeah. it's a, this is a beautiful piece of music, and it's, uh, you know, you might think, well, it's clichéd, but in fact it's very appropriate. No wonder what's number two.